actually it looks like being a pleasant weekend and finally that fresher and more bearable air is in right across the United Kingdom now so it's going to be much more comfortable across the south as it's going to be much cooler than it has been for several nights as temperatures are going to be down to 13 or 14 degrees and for most it's going to be dry cool and clear and really for many of us tomorrow it's going to be a beautiful July day fine and dry with plenty of sunshine the one exception is going to be northern Scotland some thicker cloud here with some patchy drizzly rain coming through and that'll gradually fizzle out as we go through the afternoon just one or two little drizzly showers left to the north of the Great Glen quite cool and blustery here a lot of cloud too for western scotland but we'll see some brighter breaks down towards the southeast looks like being ideal golfing weather for st andrews and certainly it's beautiful for getting out and about perhaps walking across the pennines or going down to the beach perhaps a little bit too not too much wind for sailors and surfers but it'll be beautiful swimming and even along the coast we'll see temperatures of around 25 degrees so it'll be lovely for getting out and about going to a party, perhaps going for a barbecue, and even Wales too will see that beautiful July weather with plenty of bright sunshine coming through, and it will feel really quite pleasant in those light winds. Still a little bit of sunshine left in southeastern Northern Ireland through the afternoon. Now for Sunday, again, fine weather for many of us across England and Wales and southeast Scotland. If anything, the sunshine a little bit warmer, but still some thicker cloud up towards the northwest, some outbreaks of drizzly rain, and rather cool and blustery. But things are looking set to change for the start of next Next week certainly it's going to turn a little bit cooler in the north a mixture of sunshine and blustery showers but one or two places will escape them and that's going to be more especially across southern and eastern parts of england and wales but elsewhere we'll get those showers and that's the weather for